five. There's no word yet on the circumstances surrounding this violent death. But Honolulu police are still investigating at this time. KITV 4's Tom George joined us now live tonight from the scene. Tom, what have you found out so far? Yeah, and this is all happening right here in this uh, busy residential area right here in the Makiki Punch Bowl area. Still very much an active scene. Multiple police units on scene right now. You can see they have this area blocked off where this stabbing happened. As you mentioned, uh, we're told that that victim was stabbed to death multiple times. Uh, we are told from police sources that they do have a suspect in custody, uh, so no immediate uh, danger to the public right here, but they are still investigating. I'm going to step out of the way and show you this area. Um, the investigation centering around this house right there. We've seen crews going in and out again. We did, we did hear from some people that were nearby that said that they uh, saw the victim uh, being taken out in a pool of blood. Again, stabbed multiple times uh, to death in this area. Obviously, a lot of people really in shock here. Neighbor, this is a residential area. Um, we still don't know what stabbing that's still part of the investigation. And uh, we're waiting for the police crew uh, to give us a little bit more information uh, fairly soon. But in the meantime, again, this is all happening in a busy area. They have this area blocked off. All this was going on at the same time that Roosevelt High School across the street was having a football game. So there was already large crowds of traffic anyway. Now a large police presence there as well, uh, creating a lot of uh, chaos in this area. But now, uh, again, uh, they, do, they do have a suspect in custody at this point, but uh, still very much an active investigation out here. It's still blocked off. And of course, once we find out more about this, we'll get you more updates as soon as they come in. For now, reporting Live, Tom George, KITV4, Island News. Okay.